quarter of a million dollars per car. But the first line was Ford in the quarter mm -hmm. lost sixty-five thousand dollars per vehicle. And as Ron Barron pointed out, Tesla, they're already making what they're making eight or nine thousand per one company loses sixty-five. Right. The other company makes eight or nine. Is that the time to give people a discount? <laughs> No, a 25% pay increase as you're trying to transition from Ford oh, okay. into the UV. Is that the time right. to and, stay competitive? That you, is that going to work? And that Who's is a huge disadvantage for, for the legacy automakers end up until the UAW yeah. sets its sight on Tesla, which it already has. Uh, meantime, we have uh, some breaking news here just out on a high-profile U.S. diplomatic meeting set up for next week. Eamon Jabber joins us now with more details here being released about the Xi-Biden meeting. That's right, Melissa. Good morning. We now have official confirmation of this long-discussed meeting between Joe Biden and Chinese President Xi Jinping, which will take place on Wednesday the 15th, that's next week, uh, in the San Francisco Bay Area, they're saying. They're not putting a specific location on it. This will be the first time the two leaders have met in person since their big meeting last November in Bali. Now, the phrase we heard from U.S. officials about this last night, and I expect we're going to continue...